Hello. 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 Hello
we have arrived at our foodie destination yeah. for the day, finally. We are at Hinome Ichiba, Hinome Market, which is also known as Kochi's Kitchen. So it's basically a melting pot of all of the different delicacies from all over Kochi. So in this little market, there are around 65 to 70 different stalls. And how it works is you choose your favorite, you pick up whatever you want, get a table you sit down and you rub shoulders with all the locals so we have picked up coach's number one delicacy katsu no tadaki this sick so good yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. plus we have a whole load of other things so we have our nori tempura so seaweed tempura some kind of conga eel i think all them are famous yeah so i heard that this one is quite hard to come by in general because they're quite bitey <laughs> so that's a very hard to get delicacy i gather plus we have yatai gyoza and apparently yatai times gyoza times beer is kochi style plus Another Koji speciality, um, I guess. He already wrapped in chikua fish cakes. Fast time to see, actually. Yeah, it looks really good. <laughs> well, no, but this is an absolute feast. Not only that, but it's like a feast for the eyes. I think there's like seven different sections to this entire market. We're just sat by like a shutter, but all of these places are like stores. There's like tons of people just like having a beer. It's like midweek, just the perfect place to relax. Hi. So first, Kurine. I'm curious about Ooh. how <laughs> how to eat it. So I guess we get given a little soy sauce thing. It kind of feels like getting a supermarket sushi. I mean, I guess the flavor is probably as you would expect, but let's see. So I guess cucumber is famous in the region. So I heard that having it with kawabi is pretty famous too, but we haven't found any. Instead, we have found this one. What's that? Well, no. How do they stuff it in there? Like, it's perfectly stuffed. <laughs> I think, I guess this is mayonnaise as well. First taste of kochi, finally. <laughs> I'm actually like shocked. Um, I mean, I thought I, I knew what the like what to expect what flavor was coming but no like yeah. that cucumber is the crunchiest cucumber i've ever tasted i don't know if it's like freshly picked this morning or what but that's incredible it's so fresh it's so crunchy that's a first mm. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm! <laughs> the best appetizer. So you on to the main dish. This so shiny. So what's the sauce? Like lemon kare or ah, lemon and salt. Or something. I think lemon and salt. Wow. A little garlic, negi. Koste. So mat mat simple it meo. <laughs> that good? The smell is perfect. They just burn this in the shop. That's what this place is kind of famous for, like the yeah. straw, water, burning. So today, I just asked Kiwi. <laughs> She's driving. Okay, don't make a big deal of it. <laughs> Let's just pretend this moment isn't happening, okay? <laughs> so we got the salt version and you can see like it's really thick like sea salty kind of grains it's like perfectly seasoned wait okay simple just on its own no flavor just the salt actually i think the true taste of kochi wow it is beautifully beautifully char grilled that little outside the soft squishy inside the salt like it the umami like it kind of punches you in the mouth <laughs> like that is insane i've never had katsu this good <laughs> so <laughs> this eel so anyone who has ever watched the little mermaid might know ursula's little like bitey friends i never thought i'd be eating a disney villain <laughs> thank you 
It's like a really rich kind of fishy, oily, like it's not strong fishy taste, but like really, really good fish and chips. That butter. White fish. Yeah. It's really light actually. I say oily, I don't mean like greasy oil. I mean like kind of melts in your mouth sensation. Who knew that Disney villains would be delicious? And? <laughs> this. <laughs> yeah, so like this place is basically like your own lol food theater. It really is a feast for the mouth and for the eyes. Look at that. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. I've had tempura before, but that might be my new favorite. <laughs> Lemon the ice on them. Not true, true. Lemon. No. It's so good to put them in. I saw like more stinky. Because <laughs> it looks so angry. But it's just a light fish. Just a bit. Tiny girl is so good. Massy, I think. Oh, my bit was really soft. My bit was massy. Oh. Around the neck, what happened? The angry part, <laughs> wherever it uses the most muscles. Actually, quite thick though. Potato chips no aonori no oishii toko dake It's okay. We have said that 2023 is the year of health. That gold is like looking like okay. Yeah, it's like super grilled. Look at that. This place is so good. This is a little bit of 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 a little bit Unknown packaging. <laughs> Another good thing is that it's open like basically all hours, right? Yeah, from morning, 10 or something. I think a few places have kind of opened up since 6 since we've come here. But in general, like you can come here, you can get lunch, you can probably get like a late breakfast. They have, yeah, fruits, vegetables, as well as all this kind of fried stuff. Kaiko uh ne? -huh. Garlic dot. Garlic dot. Negi dot. Lemon. Lemon the koro yabai. Dozo. It tastes like almost like a really good yakiniku. Eh? Like that lemon, Mon. and then like I guess that kind of burnt, like not burnt, but like the seared taste. No, it kind of adds to the meaty, like umami. Yeah. Like, umami chiba, getchiban. Suki. I mean, Tatsu itself is amazing, mm -hmm. but the best match is I just can't get over how perfectly formed it is. Like so simple but so good. Being here kind of reminds me of being back in Singapore with like all of the hawker centers, like you just sit next to complete strangers. It almost feels like we're like outside in like hot country almost, don't you think? Somehow? True. Inside but outside. Hot oh, center vibes. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Anyway, last. Last katsu. Katsu like you've never ever ever had before. The best katsu ever eat. Absolutely. Actually. Yeah, there is no mistake about no. that. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, Kochi. I thought I would have got used to it, but each time it just hits you. Every time. That is so good. Quote, psycho sugiru. I did not expect when we decided that we were going to come here for our foodie trip today that it was going to be quite this good. But this isn't the last of Shikoku or all of its speciality foods. So where are we going to be next time? Don't forget to subscribe to find out. Yep. And of course, if you want to help us eat more good food around Japan, do not forget to check out our coffee page to help support our channel. Yes. Wanna go to us?
っちゃ安いのどこだよ、めちゃ。はい、せーの、じゃあねー。